It's a weekend on Blender Market from 27 until 30 November. A lot of products are 25% off, like this blocker add-on which you can use to spawn blocks into the scene, join them to one object and then stylize it. Here duplicate such an object and show you different styles. You can make a truss, do taper, bevel and such operations. There is also a shape generator and you can convert your shape to low poly. Here an example of generated shapes I did with the blocker add-on, but there are more possibilities than that. EV Express EV Express is an add-on I use every single day. It has two light rigs, 40 presets with backdrops and lighting setups. Because the add-on takes care of render settings, irradiance, volume, reflections, probe, light settings, you can set up a scene very fast for the EV render engine. Here you see I adjust the lights and I don't need to leave the EV Express add-on. It provides also node groups for the compositor that works on linear data, like the pivoted contrast node. MOA Gen. MOA stands for Modular Asset Generator. And the add-on makes part out of profiles and with these parts you can build assets. There are templates provided for profiles as well as assets. This means that you only have to choose, adjust or make your profile and create modular assets. I use this mainly to make corridors, railings, roads, platforms, but you can also make buildings with it. Material Nodes The Material Nodes add-on provides more than 40 node groups that are procedural. You can use them as building blocks to make your own materials. Because node groups can be used as shader or as mask, there are loads of possibilities. In the package you will find also 165 materials you can load into your favorite asset manager. Like glass, leather, stucco, dielectric surfaces, fabric, metals, marble and more. My favorite node group is the Farshad node group, which makes every material that looks sterile more natural. I use it all the time. And another uh, node group I use often is the Vertex Gold node group, like you see over here. Inserts for GitOps. Here I showed you the latest edition of the Inserts for GitOps. It's an industrial cyber pack. But there are other packs included, like buttons, sliders, decorations, cutters, and more. I keep the cutters simple because you will want to use a bevel at the end, so these inserts are all bevel friendly. EV Production Suite The EV Production Suite is all about EV. It includes the EV Express add-on and the Material Notes add-on. This because these two add-ons complement each other. I offer them for a cheaper price if you want to get both the add-ons. As a bonus, the VSE transitions are also included in this package. Plugs for Mesh Machine the most magical add-on to me is the mesh machine with this plug feature. In this package there are some plugs like buttons, knobs, sliders, but also decoration and some symbols from Egypt. If your mesh has enough polys, then using these plugs is a piece of cake. Assets for Level Builder Level Builder is an amazing add-on that still works for Blender 2.91. You can build scenes very fast and it doesn't consume much memory. This because the assets are linked. Most of the assets in this package are created with the Morris Gen add-on, so they are all modular assets. The package contains assets for flooring, railings, corridors, stairs, fences, walls and even some organic assets.
EV shaders. These shaders are semi-procedural, allows two or more textures and use several tricks to get rid of tiling. For example, you scale one texture differently, distort the UV, multiply noise on top. Another trick is that you can generate the fuse map out of two normal maps, just two normal maps. There are 260 normal maps and 260 masks provided. <coughs> and the last one is the Organic Asset Pack. If you find, want to find out more, check the link below in the description and thanks for watching.